Atomic Compare Exchange. Multi-core CPU architectures provide instructions that allow us to atomically manipulate an integer. Think add, subtract, multiply, divide. In addition to basic arithmetic, we also have a compare exchange instruction. And here's how that works. The instruction first asks if the memory is equal to our condition. Then set the memory to our set value. All of this logic happens atomically. By atomically we mean as if this were a single instruction and no other instruction can be run at the same time. This is a very important guarantee inside of a multi-core CPU architecture. Without this guarantee, we would be unable to synchronize any data across threads in a guaranteed manner. The Atomic Compare Exchange instruction is the fundamental mechanism behind all thread synchronization. One of my favorite ways of using this mechanism is to synchronize shared memory access. For example, we have a process and another, and they both map the same memory. We can use a compare exchange instruction to synchronize access between both of these processes. Here is an example of how this can be implemented. Lock takes the memory address we're synchronizing, it casts it as an atomic, and then uses the built in C compare exchange strong function. This function spins until it successfully gains access to the lock. Wait uses the atomic load mechanism to validate that the lock is released. It'll loop until that condition is met. Unlock, naturally, is only expected to be called by the thread that has succeeded in obtaining the lock. Simply reverts the value to its unlocked state. 